Good morning, everyone. Good morning. Good morning. Happy Sabbath. So nice to see everyone here from all the churches. But yeah, so we just like to, um, I know for some of the Park Island folks remember, we were trying to give a little summary of Adventists in Action um, last month, but that didn't quite work out, so it's here again. Um, Good morning and happy Sabbath, everyone. God, God bless you. <laughs> so this is just a, a little slideshow of uh, Adventists in Action. So this is just basically um, the name we came up for the for us as a church working in the community, bring, spreading love in the community, and just doing uh, doing work for God and for others. So yeah, that's our little plan. And this is one of our first events. I know it was District Day. That time when we first started, actually, we went to Skelton Place and we handed out, we made a lot of sandwiches and handed out um, same series of videos of Geo <laughs> praying for the food. Yeah, so like all, all of you guys over there, so it was like a very beautiful time. Here's a, just some pictures of the kids helping us prep all the things for the bags. Um, let's see what else. Oh yeah, uh, this is something we've always been doing, but now it's part of our Adventist and Action program that we go to Helia Nursing Home every third Sabbath of the month to sing for the rest of the you can see they're really happy to have that time with us. Okay, here's quad day. So we're actually also trying to reach out to the university community because I don't know if you've noticed, but Park Avenue is in this really nice place right between the university and the rest of the community. So we wanted to attract um, the, the university students as well to come out and help us do community service. So um, our members were here at quad day when all the students were just coming in to hand out flyers and things and spread information. And <coughs> So um, there have been several students who have been actually uh, contacting us and saying that they're interested in community service. Um, so that was quad day. Oh, this was um, our back of hugs last August. We had a lot of folks also from the Champagne Madison Avenue Church who came out with us that day. Um, and then this is where we were helping one of the ladies who was coming out to our um, Revelation Seminar. Yeah, our Revelation Seminar. So Gio went uh, with one of our one of his friends, who was not from the church, by the way, and he just wanted to help and uh, did a lot of yard work for our, our friend. Yeah. And oh yeah, so here's the Kilian Nursing Home once again. This one was actually really um, special as well because a couple people from Champagne Church came, and we had some beautiful. Almost all the residents actually came out to see us. That day. It was really a blessing. Oh, So I didn't have pictures of the actual events on my computer. But basically, what what we did was another thing. Fun thing for the students is we uh, basically these are our buddies. Um, that I have at home, and we brought them out to the university and said everyone can come pet a bunny, you know, to calm down from stress from exams and things. And uh, we put up a Facebook event, and somehow people started to see it, and before I know it, there were like 300 people who wow. said they were interested in it. Wow. And so a lot of those people actually came right here. <laughs> yes, that day, um, I was basically named uh, my three bodies, I mean, our three bodies, <laughs> with a bunch of students. So I, I, I we set the, the thing here with the bunnies, and then when I see from there, just like 50 or 80 students just coming. <laughs> and, I, and I go inside of the cage with the bunnies, and I say, I know that we had a lot of students. I just do something. So we're going to pet everybody, everybody going to get the chance. So and then everybody also went to feed. So what I did, okay, if you guess the number that I need to write in my cell phone, so you can feed the rabbit from 1 to 10. 
And the answer was like, wow, and then I like, wow, all the numbers. And no one said the number six. <laughs> no, we said all the numbers. No, there is just one more. And then one student said six, and I said, what did you say? She said six, okay, you can be the right. And then, yeah, we have fun, so. And then we pass uh, Step to Christ Literature, and Globe Books, and some flyers. So I, I hold my bunny with one hand, in my other hand, the book, and then, hold this, and the right. <laughs> and then I, someone, they still got um, her students, so came and she had a group over there with another bonus. Another bonus show up as well, so basically we have seven or eight bonus there. <laughs> Praise the Lord! But yeah, basically it was a lot of fun, and we just wanted to kind of get out there and know the students get to know us. So, yeah, we're doing a lot of things. And so if you want to help keep track of us, Please check us out online. We actually updated our, our website, so now it's just adventistinaction.org. And so it looks a lot better than the that we had before. So yeah, please um, check that out. We're on Facebook, YouTube, and Twitter. And these are just some things that are coming up. We're actually doing therapy bunnies again because so many people were like, we want you to come back. So like, okay, we're gonna come back this afternoon and just spend more time with them. Um, so anyone, if anyone is interested, they can come join us. Um, we're going back to back to Parts Church next year on Tuesday. And Tuesday and Thursday home is always the third week of the month. And still the place on the um, last week, last week. Yes, yeah, so basically the main idea is we start in our um, lesson, a community service. So never is too late. We didn't start a community service in your community. So you have time yet. So I think the main idea is to to your community as God uh, from discernment. So and just do everything according to what you need. So in the area that we live, we have over 30,000 students so in the university, so we should do something for those students. Also we have uh, um, the shelter and different places. So I think that we need to study the community, ask for discernment to God, and just be in action. That's it, because think and don't act is just like a faith and dead faith. So I think that, I hope that you can continue if you're doing something, if you're not just go straight and do something for your community, because uh, if we spread the love of God as soon as possible, Jesus is going to come more soon. So and do we want to be in the new heaven with Jesus Christ? So, if your answer is yes, so let's just do it in his name. Thank you so much, and God bless you all, and happy Sabbath, and happy district day. Thank you. 